In the last instalment of Fight Vision, I spoke to Gary Walkham. Once you lose, you go back down to the bottom. And so I've got to work my back, way back up. And I believe I will get my British title back. And Larry Olibamiwo and his trainer, James Cook, MBE. I'm, I'm in the game to win titles at the highest level. It's big, but it's very quick, you know, and it does punch hard. At London's York Hall, the crowds are in, the beer is flowing, and there's already been an upset in the form of Kevin Conception's loss to the flamboyant Yasin El Marchi. Morecambe fighter David Ingleby was watching intently from the stands in preparation for his heavyweight contest with Oliver Miwo. The local man started the first round hard and fast and had the better of the exchanges, forcing Ingleby to cover up and even to miss on occasion. Ingleby did more than just survive though, connecting with some meaningful combinations, especially later in the round. Ingleby came out fighting at the start of round two. Here he goes, he lands. It looks like a bit of a scrap for the next few seconds. Oliver Miwo slows it down with the jab. Ingleby was probably not prepared for what came next. Ingleby was up for eight, but it was all over just a few seconds later when Oliver Miwo put him down again and the ref decided he wanted to see no more. To be honest, I don't remember much. Um, all I know is that um, I threw a jab and I, as he was about to throw a shot, I countered quickly with a right hand and I put him on the floor. And to be honest, the ref shouldn't have let him carry on um, because he, he was finished. He took a lot of power shots, he, he, he tucked up and it, it took a few, a few shots to actually take him out in the end. Um, apart from me going mad in the first round where I got caught with a few shots, um, the second round I calmed down, put my, put my work together calmly behind the jab and um, got the job done. Now it was Gary Walkham's turn to fight. Yanis Chinescus stepped up for the contest at the last minute and was to be an unknown quantity for Walkham. Walkham showed his slick skills early on and moved well, winning the first two rounds. His early work paid off in the third when he landed a slick shot on the chin of Chinaskis. The young Slovakian showed immense strength holding out to the end of the fight. I thought it was a bit messy really, but remember I've done what I had to do. I put him away in the third or fourth he went down. I didn't think he was going to get off of there. It was a good right hand. He's shut, his head bounced off the floor. I thought he was gone. I thought he was like, yo, Danny Parson, I knocked him out with a left hook. And uh, I was just surprised. I was seeing him to get up after seven. I thought, ah. Oh, Ref might not let it go on, and, and he did, so I was really surprised. So uh, we'll sit down and have a little talk with Frank, and, and we're, uh, well, I, I don't mind having an eight round, an extra ten, then going for a title. If we have another warm up fight and a title comes up, I'll take it. I'm just, uh, I believe if a big fight comes up, take it, grab it with both hands. 